One day you and I could bring our guitars, we could do this live, that lead in. I would have to get or borrow one, but we could definitely attempt, and yes. And then I'd have to learn how to play. Yeah. <laughs> so, that Friday being said. Time. Yes, Al Aver, he got to uh, a new spot, but it's a gas station, so you know he's on cloud nine. He's in his glory. Yes. Al Aver and Hit and Run uh, Convenience Store, Johnson Street, Shrimp Fettuccine, go. Hey, we are back. We are at the Hit and Run on Johnson Street in Lafayette, Louisiana. We are making shrimp fettuccine at a gas station. Britt Mouton, he's the guy who started all this. Miss J, she's the one who makes it all happen in the kitchen. So, we were talking about ingredients earlier. You have put your onions in the oil, and I mean, you're frying them. Right. Now, and then I'm gonna add my peppers. Now, how long, how long do you do? When do you know that this, this is ready? What's I that? basically kind of give it an eyeball and look at it. I don't want my customers to taste nothing crunchy. Oh. I just want them to have flavor, so I make sure I saute my onions and peppers really, really well. Now, that's a lot. This is going to be a big batch, isn't it? Absolutely. Ba ba how much do you think this is Two batches. Be? We have two stores, Khalees Lassoon yep. and Khalees this Lassoon. one. Uh huh. Oh, you, 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 and you cook she for both of them. <laughs> yes, sir. Well, she's from Homa, Brent. You know that. <laughs> but, we, but we love her, even if she's from Homa. Yes. You know. And so you're, you're, you're doing double duty here. Yes, sir. Now, at what point? I mean, how long does it take for this to get to where it's perfect for you? I would say about ten minutes. Okay. So what yeah, would take? So. Um, and then after you put this in, it's where you want it to be. What do you add next? I'm going to add my cream cheese. Okay. And let that cook, cook in there a little while. My shrimp. I'm going to add the shrimp and then I'm going to add the cream cheese. Let them cook. And then I add my half and half and heavy whipping cream. Woo! And then I, <laughs> I love put that. our Velveeta cheese. Now, Brent, let me ask you. You guys do plate lunches every day? Yes. Yep. And what is your most popular plate lunch? I would say Friday, the shrimp fettuccine. Here you right go. Here. And we're <laughs> this here. One right this here. Right here. We're here on Friday doing shrimp fettuccine. Uh, when it comes to the, the hot box, I love your hamburgers. They're really, really good. Uh, and I do, I, I do like your chicken tenders as well. What in the hot box? What, what do people like? Because it's grab and go. Some people are going to school. They're going to work. They come here and grab some. What, what, is, what do people like in there? Our breakfast sandwiches sell good. Our biscuits are a good seller. Uh, for lunch, obviously, our, our chicken fingers. Um, and new on the menu, our hot, hot dogs with homemade hot, chili. Hot oh! With homemade chili. I yep. saw that. Two hot dogs for five ninety nine. dollars Yes, so sir. So the chili recipe, I, I want to just chat about that a little bit. The recipe. With uh, your recipe, once Ms. again, we, we, we keep we keep it simple. Yeah. Okay. I love that. It doesn't have to be complicated mm -hmm. to be good. That's an important thing. It does not have to be complicated to be good. Hey, you know what? This show's not complicated. It's a good show. We're gonna go back to you guys in the studio. We're here at the Hit and Run on Johnson Street. We're cooking up a storm.